Hello everyone, we are back in Medieval Mod again today, my name is Adredden, we need to go find a Mortar and Pestle, so let's go have some fun and do this. Alright guys, um, so, yeah, as I was editing and stuff yesterday, I realized that uh, I sh probably should have just stayed near town, wherever the church was, somewhere, probably right here. Boom. Um, how easy is that going to get be to get back? Not too bad. So what I might do is try to cut across country around over to here. Uh, see if there's any other POIs I can see along the way. It's daytime now, so we should probably get going uh, because it's way easier to find things. Horse, what are you doing? Get off there. You're just being silly. And... Um, yeah, because I have no idea what I'm going to find this way, but I do know that the church is a decent source of, um, well, alchemy bench and other things. Uh, possibly the mortar and pestle. Pestle. Um, sometimes that's a good one. Uh, that one doesn't have a chimney. Whoa, there's a bear there. One of the chimney is a good one. So um, if we find one of those ones, we'll kind of use it, but... Oh there, horsey. Can we get up here? I think we can. As long as we don't get ambushed by some sort of bandit or something, we should be alright. There we go. Alrighty. So we are in roughly headed towards where we need to go. What's that one? I think I've already checked that one. Yes, sir. That was a quick turnaround. So we're just going to cut across here because this is about where I start to deviate. Take that punk yourself. Um, I don't know, I think this might end up being a shorter video just due to the fact that I don't really have a lot of time anymore to record today. And really there's only one major thing to do, so... I'm going to check a couple of houses along the way. If something crazy happens, I'll let you know. Oh wait, maybe we can uh, show some interesting thing here. As long as we don't get freaking raided. Uh, well, first off, no, I don't think this house is big enough to do that. Um, but I think basically at this point, for our human nation, um, we need to start breaking the law. Otherwise, everyone who did. Uh, actually, this is that is a work. I think. Don't mind me. Just gonna reach in and grab stuff. Out of your house. This is actually kind of a <laughs> silly thing to have grabbed and scrapped. Um, it's a very different game when you're trying to play it with even a little bit of morals uh, versus just I don't know, not having any moral qualms. Um, so, but I think to make this whole series progress, we got to break our uh, moral position. For the sake of the game, so. Um, ooh, hello. Let's uh, take a look in here. Oh, yeah, this is one of the tricks you can do to make people. Uh, I don't know. They really dislike you a lot. <laughs> so. But, once you get them out of their house... Ah, oh, dang it! That was terrible timing. Okay, then. You can do this, and then you don't have to actually kill them. So that's kind of nice. I don't need that. We only need one thing. I've got food. And it's not here. I'll see you guys when I find a mortar and pestle or at the church. Okay guys, this is actually one of the uh, houses that... Wait, I think I heard something. That's a good one. Yeah, okay, um... It's just got... It, well, generally it's pretty good. Hi? Oh god! <clears throat> okay, that's good. Get her out of that house. Like I said, it's... 
It's pretty good to just lock them out. <laughs> they don't bother you anymore. Boop. Oh, this guy's probably gonna bug us. But nope. We might find something good over here. And it's not like amazing or anything, it's just got a number of small little things. Okay, well, there you go. Alright, here's a big POI. Let's go take a look at this one. This is gonna be a hard one to loot because there's um so many doors and whatnot. Some of these things, so. Close that. Okay, I don't really know that there's much actually in here. Alright. So. Ah. Some little tricks we can do is just pop in and out like that. Hi! <laughs> I wasn't in there. Um, if you guys are thinking you need some bird's nests, here's a nice little like feathers and stuff. Neat little trick that didn't come to me right away, but eventually did, is you just like sneak in here <laughs> like that uh, and with the birds I guess this is where they're supposed to be uh, and I guess right now we're gonna want to get the heck out of here so let's take out this block and hop up here this brings us to the outside of the little thing here we have to close those doors Lots of food in these grain bags, so that's good. Can you guys jump fences? Oh yes, they certainly can. Alrighty, where? I'm inside. Yes, good. You're here. Hi. Some good stuff over here. Is this guy gonna follow us out? He. I think he must be neutral. Those doors. Nope. Okay, now we can loot a little bit in here. I'm... Hi. Really only looking for one little thing. Uh, and it's not any of that stuff. I need... More pestle. So yeah, here's another alchemy bench. Pile of books. Nothing. Beers. There's a bunch of chests out here. Nope. Nope. Hmm, and a workbench. So like this is, you know, ugh, one of your best POIs. Considering it has both the workbench, the alchemy bench. Uh, that makes it really quite good. And then there's some more stuff up here. Beds. Mostly, yep. Don't jump into the fireplace, because that'll burn ya. Okay, that one's all searched. Hi there. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Other than that, there's whatever's in here. I think it's just grain and hay. Which could come in handy to have the extra hay. Alright. I've come for your hay. Goodbye. I'm the Midnight Bandit who steals hay. I don't know. Uh, let's move on. This is actually a really good one because it's got, well, it's raised on three sides and it's got a light beside it. So that's pretty, it's awesome in a lot of different ways. Um, yeah, anyways, see you guys in a moment. And we are back at the church. So I'll probably have to, uh, unfortunately, deal with these people. Horse, where are ya? There you are. Okay. So, uh, this is always... Unfortunate. Plus, I'm not actually that not good at health, so... Oh, that dude. Oh, they're just scared. Those ones are scared. Some of them hate you. Some of them are really just scared. Whew. There's another church over there we can check out. That is good. Let's uh, run you around. This is my town, by the way. So, I, this is where I'm actually at. Um, it's not that good. Close that. I'm sure there'll be lots of trouble to be had here. So the alchemy bench is back here. Oh dang, there's so many of them. Who's, that one's angry. We'll lead them out. 
for your own good. Thank y'all. Bless you to, you know, have to deal with. Please, out of my way. All right. I don't think she actually was a problem. Please get away from the corner. Please get. Alchemy bench. Nothing. Dang it. Um. So. Actually, that could be pretty useful. Scrap. Okay. I'll open up the secret. And anything good down here? Uh oh. Two dudes. They might be aggressive. Right, nothing. Two of these have something in them, but I guess maybe it's just this one. Okay, let's find out. Just a bunch of money. Bah, what good is that? Out of here. What was that back up for these guys? I was thinking also upstairs might have some goodies. Because there's a lot of chests. So, let's take a look. I think I have enough cloth for now, or I did anyway. I don't know where it's all at. I always forget to search these tables. It's always hell's thing. No, no, no. <clears throat> this is the, um... Sorry, Shirley. Hard part about doing um, a Let's Play and have it relying on your random world gen if you don't have incredible amounts of time what about you? You um to record. Oh, ogre blood. Take that. Incendiaries. Read. I think. Hmm, I wonder if we could do stores in this game, like legit stores. Or there's going to be a trader inside of it. That way you could just like actually buy stuff from people without having to murder people. <laughs> Hopefully book two. But we'll see. Cauldron? Two cauldrons? Seriously? Wow. Today's my lucky day for cauldrons. Okay, well that's this POI. Oh wait, there's one more room. Books of fairy tales. These people not have any practical things in their life. Uh, and then there's beer back here and some more cupboards. Just don't care about anything but. Actually, what's my water at? Yeah, I'm all right. Okay. Um. Sounds like my time is running out, so I'm going to end it officially here, and then I'm going to keep going. Um, so, if you guys liked this episode, hit that like button. Oh, hi, all you guys. Um, and if you want to see more content by me, hit the subscribe button. We are working towards building a purge crystal or five for having a, you know, blight free base. Um, whether or not we can do this, I'm not quite sure. I do want to move to B15, um, but I actually, and depending on how long this takes, I may just stop this particular playthrough and do a whole different thing. Uh, this is this building. Oh gosh, those are some big old cliffs. Ugh. Are you guys building in a crazy, crazy area? Nice road. Um, yeah, anyways, 
and if you want to support the channel you can head on over to patreon don't forget to hit the bell we have a zombie horde actually uh right where is it there it is down there oh my what are you you guys are fast i've never seen ones go that quick before they're the zombies hmm that's neat check what my game stage is are they feral are they hunting me i don't know huh Okay, well then. Are we good? Let's go up to the church and see. Or let's go over here and see what's going on. Can't see much. I think what I'm going to do is hop off and get my bedroll happening. And um, yeah, see what goes on there. Anyways, I'll probably end this episode without a bye-bye. We'll see. Horse. Oh, I did have it. Err. Stop. Uh, I need some blind fiber. Um, I'll see you guys in a moment. Or not. Okay, I've actually never seen this POI before. That's cool. What is this? A uh, type of church. Just doesn't look like it's completed. Cool. Very nice work. 